You said uh, that the president will be watching the VP debate today. That I trust that he supports Tim Kaine as he goes there. The last time that Senator Kaine was at Longwood University, he said to a class there, he said, we have operational plans, but no strategy. We have a plan for what to do if North Korea were to move across the border into South Korea. We have a plan for what we would do if Putin decided to move Russian troops into a NATO allied country. We have plans for all these eventualities, but we don't have a strategy. That was from the man who hopes to be Vice President, Tim Kaine. What does the President say to Tim Kaine about that commentary on this administration and our lack of a foreign policy strategy more broadly? Yeah. Well, uh, th this is the first I'm hearing of those comments. What I will say is that the President and his national security team are always working through uh, contingency plans. Uh, and there is a focus on making sure that the American people uh, and our interests are protected around the globe, uh, even in the event of uh, you know, urgent situations like uh, the prospect that were uh, floated in those two scenarios. Um, you know, certainly um, demonstrating a commitment to our NATO alliance is something that President Obama has done throughout his presidency. And uh, because of those efforts, that alliance has been strengthened uh, over the eight years that he's been in office. The president traveled uh, earlier this summer and actually made up a commitment about an enhanced U.S. military presence uh, in the eastern part of NATO. Uh, and I know there are similar commitments from the Canadians and others uh, to demonstrate uh, the strength of uh, uh, our NATO alliance. And um, you know, with regard to North Korea, we've talked quite a bit about the efforts that have been put in place to ensure that the American people are safe from any provocative actions that are undertaken by the North Korean regime.